Today is December 3rd, 2024. On December 3rd in 1992, engineer Neil Papworth sent the world's first text message from a computer to a mobile phone over the Vodafone network. The message read, Merry Christmas. And since then, texting has become a standard form of communication worldwide. My name is Nicodemus, and welcome back to the Disruptive Technologies Podcast. The European Union is rolling out new rules for artificial intelligence to ensure that it grows safely and responsibly. At the same time, it's pushing forward technological advances that benefit everyone. In a major move led by industry experts in nearly 1,000 stakeholders, the European Union has introduced the first draft of the General Purpose AI Code of Practice. This code is an important addition to the EU's existing AI regulations. It complements the initial EU AI Act that started August 1st. The GPAI code is designed to tackle the unique challenges posed by foundational AI models. These models include large language models and generative AI systems. They power a wide range of applications and can be customized for specialized tasks by businesses and developers. Under the EU AI Act, the newly created AI Office is tasked with establishing these codes of practice by May 2nd, 2025. If companies follow these codes, they'll be considered compliant with the EU's final AI rules that are set to take effect on August 2nd, 2025. Essentially, adhering to the code gives GPAI providers a safe harbor from potential violations of the EU AI Act until the final regulations are in place. Now, the code is focused on guiding GPAI providers to meet their obligations. It's especially important for AI models that come with higher risks, such as misuse or unintended consequences. Key areas to be covered include transparency and how models are developed and used. It also involves managing risks associated with powerful AI systems. Additionally, the code ensures that everything stays ethical and legally compliant. The core principles of the code match AI's developments with EU values and legal standards. It stresses that regulations should match the level of risk and size and capacity of the providers. The code also supports the growth of the AI safety ecosystem. It ensures that regulatory measures can adapt to future technological changes. Specifically, the code lays out rules for GPAI model providers. These rules include keeping clear documentation and setting up acceptable use policies. Providers must build public trust by disclosing relevant information. The code introduces a taxonomy of systemic risks. These risks include cyber offenses, chemical and biological risks, control over AI models, and large-scale discrimination. Providers are required to continuously evaluate and mitigate these risks through robust safety and security frameworks. As the code moves forward, nearly 1,000 stakeholders will join discussions to refine the draft. This process ensures that the final version strikes the right balance between clear compliance requirements and flexibility for technological innovations. The finalized code is expected by April 2025. It's intended to help businesses operating in the EU adapt smoothly to the new regulations. The EU's introduction of the GPAI Code of Practice is a proactive step towards AI regulation. It plans to encourage innovation while protecting against potential risks. By involving a wide range of stakeholders in the drafting process, the EU is ensuring that the regulations are well informed and balanced. This approach addresses the concerns of both technology providers and the public. For tech enthusiasts and innovators, such as advocates of cryptocurrency and decentralized systems, the code provides a framework that encourages responsible AI development. It does not put a damper on creativity. The focus on transparency and ethical compliance matches the values of those who are wary of centralized authorities. It also helps to minimize government overreach. By setting clear guidelines, the EU is not only protecting public interests, it's also creating a predictable environment for businesses to thrive. However, the code also demonstrates the EU's commitment to managing the systemic risks that come with powerful AI systems. Balancing regulation and innovation is key to maintaining public trust while allowing technological progress to move forward. For those who love technology, this means that the EU is serious about AI and is dedicated to ensuring its growth benefits society as a whole. The EU's draft General Purpose AI Code of Practice marks a crucial moment in AI regulation. By setting comprehensive guidelines that reinforce transparency, risk management, and ethical compliance, the EU is paving the way for a balanced approach to AI development. This initiative not only protects the public from potential AI-related harms, it also supports technological innovation and growth. As the code moves towards its final form, it promises to create a secure and dynamic environment for AI improvements. This will ensure that the benefits of technology are realized responsibly and sustainably. And that's going to do it for us this time around. If you enjoyed today's episode, please don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe so you can stay updated on all things disruptive. I want to thank you for listening to this episode of the Disruptive Technologies Podcast. We'll see you next time.